Hi there, my name is Brittany and I work for Northeast Insurance Services. So for today's video, I want to talk about how to tell if an image has been photoshopped. It's happened to us all. You're scrolling through social media or the news when suddenly you find a picture that you just need to share. So you do, but suddenly people start yelling at you, telling you that it's fake. In the modern world, programs like Photoshop are easy to acquire, and it's now up to the average person to analyze nearly every photo that they come in contact with. But don't worry, Northeast is here to save the day. I have a lot of tips and tricks in how to tell if an image has been Photoshopped. First, we're gonna start with how to check the background of a photo. If everything is in focus, chances are it's multiple images Photoshopped together. In reality, objects farther away, aka the background, are going to be less in focus than those closer up in the foreground. If things look misshapen or warped, then it's a sign that the image has been edited. This is especially popular with celebrities or influencers who change their body shapes to become more appealing in beauty standards. Next up is to check the people. As much as the beauty and skincare industries want you to believe, there's no such thing as skin that is perfectly smooth or blemish free. Everyone has pores. Therefore, if you come across a photo with porcelain skin, no pores or lines, then it's been altered. Now, let's talk about the landscape. Those new to photoshopping or altering images do not take advantage of the advanced tools it provides, which usually means that they just copy and paste a portion of that image on top of what they're covering up. This leaves a pattern, which is very easy actually for our brains to spot. Let's talk about lighting. From experience, the hardest aspect to Photoshop is lighting. Usually when you put two images together, their shadows and highlights aren't gonna match up. Look at those two items together. Is the left side of one person's face shadowed and the other isn't? Light doesn't bend one way and then the other. Do the edges of objects in the same image seem too sharp or jagged? Many forget to blend or blur the edges of a object because they have similar coloring. Quality of the photo can help you identify if it has altered images. While lower resolution images can hide the signs of a faked photo, you can tell the differences based on how pixelated an image is. Also, the more altered an image is, the lower the quality the photo will have. Now, if you feel like being a digital Sherlock Holmes, you can look at the photo's metadata. And this is invisible data that digital cameras embed onto the image file. Websites or even your own photo editing program can access this metadata. Photoshopped or faked images won't have that metadata, while the original photo will have information like what camera was used and when it was taken. Finally, be extra, extra aware of sensational or trending topics. Altered images are made to anger and trigger its viewers. They want to go viral, and studies have shown that we're most likely to share an image when it makes us sad or angry. This is why fake photos become so popular online. We are not stopping to think and analyze because we're too busy feeling emotional. So if you can't tell right away if a photo is real or not, what then? Well, I've got a few resources that are free to use online, which you can easily use. First up, I have reverse Google searching. Most Photoshoppers aren't even using their own photos. They're using Google. Now you already know that Google lets you search for images based on text. You can also search with an image. If you have an image saved under your computer or you have the link to it online, you can just find similar images to it and see if it's real or not. Now there are websites that analyze images by looking at a variety of variables. For example, they'll see the differences between edges and surfaces. Three that I can recommend are Photo Forensics, Image Edited, and Image Error Level Analyzer. And there you have it. These are some tips and tricks and resources to figure out if an image has been Photoshopped or not. It's very easy to do once you start looking. Insurance services, we're more than insurance. We protect what means the most to you, and we built our business on connecting with our clients. In the comments below, what? let me know. What are some images that you found that were Photoshopped? Did you like them? Did you not? And while you're down there, be sure to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.